Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Have you ever wondered about the location of a device? Ever wanted to track something down? Today, we're diving into the world of geolocation tracking using a powerful tool called Hound. But first, a huge disclaimer. This information is for educational purposes only. Knowing how to track devices is one thing, but using that knowledge ethically is crucial. Unethical tracking is illegal and just plain wrong. Don't be that person. Now, if you're interested in learning about cybersecurity, ethical hacking, and the fascinating world of tech, hit that subscribe button. We'll be exploring more cool tools and techniques in future videos, and don't forget to stick around for the ethical guidelines at the end. Those are super important. Believe it or not, your device constantly leaves digital breadcrumbs. Think about it. Your phone connects to Wi-Fi networks, your laptop sends data through your ISP, and even your smartwatch communicates with satellites. All of these actions generate data points that can be used to pinpoint your location. The Hound framework, which we'll be using today, leverages this digital trail to provide surprisingly accurate geolocation information. It's like having a digital bloodhound sniffing out a device's whereabouts. Before we start tracking, we need the right gear. For this mission, we'll be using Kali Linux, a popular operating system for penetration testing and ethical hacking. Think of it as our digital toolbox, packed with everything we need to explore the world of cybersecurity. Next up, we have the star of the show, Hound. This open source framework, available on GitHub, will be our trusty sidekick in tracking down devices. Installing Hound is a breeze even if you're new to the world of Linux and command line interfaces. Just follow these simple steps and you'll have Hound up and running in no time. First, open your Kali Linux terminal. This is your command center for interacting with your system. Next, we'll be downloading Hound from GitHub so you'll need Git installed. If you don't have it already, simply type and hit enter. Now let's grab Hound. Type and hit enter. This will download Hound to your system. That's it, you've successfully downloaded Hound. In the next section, we'll prepare your system and install some essential software packages. Stay tuned. Section 5. Terminal Time. Getting your system ready. Before we can unleash Hound's full potential, we need to make sure our system is prepped and ready. This is a crucial step that ensures everything runs smoothly and efficiently. This involves accessing the terminal and gaining root privileges, which gives us full control over our Kali Linux environment. Root access is like having the master key to your system, allowing you to make any necessary changes or installations. Don't worry, it's not as intimidating as it sounds. With a few simple commands, you'll be ready to go in no time. Just follow these simple steps. First, open your terminal. The terminal is a powerful tool that allows you to interact with your system at a deeper level. You can usually find this by searching for terminal in your applications menu. Once you have the terminal open, the next step is to gain root access. Type and hit enter. This command tells the system that you want to switch to the root user. You'll be prompted to enter your password. This is the password you set when you installed Kali Linux. This elevates your permissions to the root user, giving you complete control over your system. With root access, you can install software, modify system settings, and perform other administrative tasks. Now that we're in the driver's seat, let's equip ourselves with the necessary software packages to run Hound effectively. This includes installing dependencies and other tools that Hound requires to function properly. To do this, we'll use the package manager to download and install the required software. This process may take a few minutes, so be patient. Once the installation is complete, you'll have all the tools you need to start using Hound. Congratulations. Your system is now ready. In the next section, we'll dive into the exciting features of Hound and how to use them to their full potential. Stay tuned. Section 6. Package Pickup. Essential Software for Hound. Think of software packages as ingredients for a delicious digital recipe. Just like a chef needs the right ingredients to create a culinary masterpiece, we need specific software to make Hound run smoothly. Hound requires a few key ingredients to function properly, namely PHP, Zip, Git, and Widget. Each of these tools plays a crucial role in the overall functionality and efficiency of Hound. Don't worry, gathering these ingredients is as easy as ordering takeout. You don't need to be a tech wizard to get these installed, just follow the steps and you'll have everything you need in no time. Here's how to install them. 1. PHP, type, and hit enter. PHP is a scripting language that Hound uses for its magic. 
it helps in processing the data and running the backend operations smoothly. 2. Zip, type, and hit enter. Zip is used for compressing and decompressing files. This is essential for managing the various files that Hound will handle. 3. Git You should already have Git installed from the previous steps. If not, type and hit enter. Git helps us download projects like Hound from GitHub. It's a version control system that tracks changes and allows collaboration. 4. WJIT Type and hit enter. WGIT is another handy tool for downloading files from the internet. It's particularly useful for fetching files from web servers. With these packages installed, our digital kitchen is fully stocked and we're ready to start cooking with Hound. Each of these tools ensures that Hound operates efficiently and effectively, making your experience seamless. So, roll up your sleeves, get these essential software packages installed, and let's get started on this exciting journey with Hound. Happy coding! Section 7. Fetching Hound Cloning from GitHub Remember that Git installation from earlier? It's time to put it to good use. We'll be using Git to clone the Hound repository from GitHub, which is like downloading a digital blueprint for our tracking tool. Here's the command you need. Paste that into your terminal, hit enter and watch as Git fetches Hound from the depths of the internet and places it safely on your system. Think of it as adopting a digital bloodhound eager to sniff out device locations. Section 8. Hound on the hunt. Running the framework and setting up Cloudflare tunnel. Now comes the exciting part. Unleashing Hound and setting up a Cloudflare tunnel. This is where all the preparation pays off and you get to see the framework in action. Don't worry, it's easier than walking a real bloodhound. The steps are straightforward and designed to be user-friendly, even for those who might not be tech-savvy. First, we need to navigate to the Hound directory in your terminal. Open your terminal application and use the CDE command to change the directory to where Hound is located. This is a crucial step as it sets the stage for everything that follows. Once you're in the correct directory, the next step is to start Hound. This is done by executing a simple command in the terminal. The command might vary depending on your operating system, but generally it's something like Hound Start. This will initiate the Hound framework and provide you with a unique URL. This URL is your gateway to the Hound interface where you can monitor and manage your tracking activities. This URL is crucial for tracking as it acts as a digital trap for unsuspecting devices. Think of it as a virtual snare that captures data from the devices that interact with it. To make this trap even more effective, we'll use Cloudflare Tunnel. Cloudflare Tunnel enhances the security and reliability of your connection, ensuring that your tracking activities remain discreet and uninterrupted. This service creates a secure tunnel between your server and the internet, masking your IP address and making your connection more reliable. It's like adding an extra layer of invisibility to your operations. Setting up Cloudflare Tunnel is a breeze and involves creating an account and following their simple instructions. Once your account is set up, you'll be guided through the process of configuring the tunnel, which typically involves running a few commands in your terminal. And there you have it. With Hound running and Cloudflare Tunnel set up, you're now ready to track and analyze data with enhanced security and reliability. It's a powerful combination that ensures your operations are both effective and secure. Section 9. Luring your target, creating the tracking link. With Hound up and running, it's time to craft our digital lure, the tracking link. This innocuous looking link will be our secret weapon in pinpointing a device's location. Hound provides you with a base URL. To make it enticing, we need to disguise it using a URL shortener like Bitly and add some social engineering flair. This involves crafting a message or a website that encourages the target to click the link. Think carefully about your target's interests and online behavior. What would pique their curiosity or entice them to click? A funny video, breaking news, a too-good-to-be-true offer? Get creative. The more believable your link and message, the higher the chances of success.